Hello and welcome back to Age of Empires Definitive Edition. Today we're starting the sixth campaign, The Rise of Rome. Rome, the very name, conjures images of steely-eyed legionnaires and opulent senators. But Rome was not built in a day. Journey back to when Rome was nothing but a modest town on the Tiber River. Follow the Romans as they overthrow their Etruscan masters, conquer Italy, and expand throughout the Mediterranean to challenge Carthage and Greece. Divide and conquer, Consul. Lucius Tarquinius, the last king of Rome, has been deposed. The new Roman Republic, under the leadership of the Senate, has many enemies. The nearby Etruscan kings envy Rome's key position on the hills overlooking the Tiber River. They seek to dominate Rome, as they did during the age of our forefathers. The various tribes of Italy, Samnites, Umbrians, Capanians, and others, also threaten the growing city-state. Rome will not be built in a day, but the defenses of the city must be. So we're um, supposed to build sentry towers net next to each flag. Concentrate on the mission at hand. This is a very important point for this map. Build more towers for a stronger defense. Remember to research the sentry tower technology. Although the Romans credited their city's founding to Romulus in 753 BCE, Latin villages existed on the seven hills besides the Tiber River as far back as the 14th century BCE. The city was formed gradually through the joining of these villages into a city-state ruled by a king and sometimes under the domination of nearby more sophisticated Etruscans. Central Italy in this period was inhabited by a diverse collection of people, the mysterious Etruscans whose origin are lost in prehistory and who spoke a language unlike the others in Italy, were a preeminent pre-Roman Italian power. Culturally, the Etruscans were influenced by Greece and uh, Phoenicia, uh, and were formed into a league of twelve cities for economic, religious, uh, and religious cooperation. Various Italic people, including the Samnites, Umbrians, and Capmanians, Campanians, formed settlements, raided, and traded in central Italy while two sets of foreign invaders exerted influence over in the north and south of the Italian peninsula. The Celtic Gauls entered Italy from the north and would even sack Rome in 390 BCE, while Greek colonists established trade and farming settlements in Sicily and southern Italy, beginning in the 8th century BCE. In 509 BCE, the Romans deposed King Lucius Tarquinius and established a republic dominated by a patrician aristocracy. By the end of the 3rd century BCE, a series of successful wars against the Etruscans, Samnites and the other Italian people culminated in Rome's domination of central Italy from the Tyrrhenian to the Adriatic Seas. Okay, so uh, <clears throat> this scenario is extremely easy to lose, um, unfortunately. Um, okay, apparently I did not hotkey these guys into a control group. So the problem with this scenario here is we have six very unfriendly uh, enemies, uh, unfriendly states, or whatever you want to call it. And they will very much um, help you to, um, to die quickly. Uh, I've tried playing this scenario defensively a couple of times, uh, but there's just no way. Um, the biggest problem is once they start rolling, um, they'll just keep going. And there's nothing um, stopping them. 
and no matter how much like defenses you decide to build and stuff like that it just doesn't matter uh, because they will they will just outrun you at that point it's very unfortunate But you can delay uh, them attacking you a little bit by uh, putting this to neutral. Uh, red um, Red, unfortunately, they have a tendency to want to rush this tower. They have a tendency to want to rush that tower. We don't really need that much wood in this scenario. I left two uh, two soldiers here to um, to help. The slingers are very effective against uh, towers, unfortunately. Okay, so we want to get sentry tower as soon as possible, really. don't really care about like destroying their buildings or whatever that's completely fine and we're gonna have to start uh yeah you uh decided to do that keep helping that please Come on, just need some food, really. We have a lot of stone now. I think we can start abandoning this. To concentrate on tower building faster. We have three at the moment, that seems correct. Should be one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Yeah, you're not gonna win that duel. Or this duel. Really adamant on building it on top of these flags. I've actually lost this because there was one of them that didn't register properly. I think these axemen are not strong enough to... to do anything, really. Yeah. It's just not enough. Okay. Should have two left. This one. And this one. Nice, so this is how you rush this map without making too much effort. With Quick 10 minute rush. Her legions march out against the Italian tribes. 
One by one, they fall to Rome's might. This success breeds fear and enmity among the Greek colonists of southern Italy. There are rumors that they have called for help against Rome. That's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching and uh, have a really nice day.